future uncertain for those guys. Can you see him blinking the lights? I mean, obviously that's to let the guy in front of you know right. you're, you're there. But it's more to aggravate the guy than anything <laughs> else. And it's true. I mean, because when you're sitting there and you're driving and you got a guy behind you blinking those lights, it's flashing in your mirror. And it is distracting. So those guys, you know, they'll do it as much as possible just to try to distract the driver in front of them. Just all they're looking for is one little mistake for that guy to make. And, and you're there. Just over four minutes left now. Tony Kanaan. <laughs> it's, it's tight right up there. Now, 15, that's Fernandez. He's a right. couple laps down, but he is in that group of cars right there. Had a fast car throughout the race. Had a problem getting it restarted on pit road. Looks like Pagino was caught back up a little bit here, too. Two Acuras running first and second in P2. When you get down to the final minutes, it's all how you catch traffic. Because if you just catch a guy in the wrong spot, you can lose a lot of ground. For example, for example, right now the Audi has pulled a little bit up on Kanan. That's for the P1 lead right there. The 26 car of Kanan, the 66 of Pagano. They're running out of time. He's going to have to make something happen. Flying around here. But Kanan is not going to just leave the door open either. No. So he's going to use the mirrors up on these last few laps. He is he's watching Pagino as much as he's watching ahead of him. You heard the call. Approximately three laps left. Kanan's just got to be careful where he catches cards. He's got to time it right so it doesn't mess him up. Kanan driving for Andretti Green, Pagano for Gilles DeFerrin and DeFerrin Motorsports, both in Acuras. Got some traffic ahead, and this is where you don't want to catch traffic, is right before the corkscrew. But they're gonna get they're gonna clear that car before they get to the top. And more guys coming behind. Oh, look, here's the move! Whoa! Well, come on! That, that was impressive right there. You can't do that, can you? <laughs> that was a great, that was good racing on both parts of those guys. And that that's, was and that's very, not, very clean. And not the last time they're doing it either. They got to get through that corkscrew again. Here it is. Here comes the move. You see Pagano. In the inside, but Kanan now has got the preferred line going down the corkscrew. In the dirt, over the curb, but nice job by both those guys of not wrecking each other. Yet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and this is for first in class. One lap to go next time. You know, Kanan's having a blast driving these cars. He really, really enjoys it. You can tell by watching. Tony Kanan in the 26, Simon Pagano in the 66. A lot of traffic ahead of these two right now. And if we're the corkscrew, this goes on about... Oh, he's threading the needle there. A couple of seconds behind the race leader, Marco Werner. Oh, and Pagano got stuck, and that, it's all over right there. That, what I said earlier, it depends on where you catch these cars in the final lap. And Pagano just caught him at the wrong place. You worked so hard for your opportunity and then lose it right there. Fernandez in the 15. Runs seventh in class. Overall leader, Marco Werner. Share the driving championship this season. He's about a second and a half in front of his teammate Piro. Making his last drive in the Audi, Emanuele Guerrero is. This is on board the 66 car. And you can see how much ground he's lost just by catching those two GT cars in the wrong place. 
Pagano trying to catch Tony Kanan. Working the final lap at Monterey. Kanan right in front of him now. Corkscrew. Not going to get him. Not gonna. Kanan's driving like his tail's on fire. <laughs> Oh, well, they get close, I think, right there all of a sudden. He, here's his last shot. Final turn, these guys all coming to the checkered flag. Marco Werner, the race leader, takes the overall win. Wow, look how close that is. Tony Kanaan. Everybody, good job.